Hello, everybody. Hi, Denifel. Nice to see you in chat. Woo, let's get the music off. Let's get the screen up. Boom. Cheers, sociable. How are you all doing today? Hope you're having a good day. Uh, nice to see you here. This is the Quicks Arcade Channel. I am Quicks. The Quicks Autics will be coming in, and we are playing the God of War. Or if you look at my title today, I'm calling it the Smart SMRT of War, because uh, that's basically the play. Yesterday, <laughs> yesterday, um, we started the, the cast with a boss fight, and we got that boss down in about 30 minutes. And then the rest of the cast, up until the end of the cast, was more or less um, progressing through the game and solving puzzles. And I'm not a particularly good puzzle solver. Uh, I, I work them out. But basically it was trying to find things, uh, finding those letters, those magical letters, to un well, the letters to unlock the magical chest, as well as uh, putting this magical, um, I don't know what you call it, what was it called? The Winds of Hell, I think, H-E-L, the Winds of Hell on the Blades of Chaos and uh, opening up portals and doors and things with them. So that's what we did yesterday. And then uh, we had to fight a few uh, uh, interim, not bosses, but a few interim enemy fights that were uh, quite challenging. And then we ended with a boss fight that isn't completed. Uh, so Smart of War, SMRT, became a catchphrase that one of the people in chat uh, uh, put into chat uh, that I liked, I thought was funny. So I made it as today's title because uh, that's basically how I go around uh, fighting enemies and solving problems. Not smart S M A R T, but uh, smart S M R T. Uh, so we're smart of war today. Uh, welcome to you. Uh, if you're new to the channel, uh, stick around. If you're looking for uh, a fun and interactive channel, if you're looking for no hit runs or professional playthroughs, uh, go somewhere else. Honestly, God, because you're in the wrong place. <laughs> now this is going to be uh, a meat and potatoes hack and slash. Um, what game is next on the list, Denifel? How far? Well, here's a good question. Denifel, have you played God of War? Have you played this game? So do you have any idea, you know, how much do we have left? How far through this game are we? Are we a quarter of the way through, a third of the way through, half of the way through, three quarters of the way through? Any idea where we are on the, uh, on the playthrough? Assuming that we do like I'm doing, which is basically just sticking to the path, uh, not taking on the side paths, just keeping on the main mission path. How far, how far into this game am I? Uh, do you have any ideas, <clears throat> you know, how much, how much longer based on the speed at which I'm playing the game and the difficulty of the enemies that I'm running into at the level that I'm playing? Don't say next year. <laughs> when do you think I'll be done the game? <laughs> um, and we, I, we don't have any idea yet what, what the next game is that we're going to play. But uh, about halfway, okay, so we've probably got about another week maybe before uh, we'll be done with God of War, unless I suddenly get good and then start wrecking enemies like crazy. Um, <clears throat> we don't have a next another game picked yet, so it depends on how much the optional content you run into. Yeah, because right now I'm not really, I'm trying to stay off of the main paths, and, sorry, trying to stay off of the side paths and just run down the main path and uh, keep on pushing the main part of the story because um, I want to make the games move forward. I want to make them progress. I want to make them fun and interactive for chat and interesting. And uh, based on, you know, based on the way I play and my style, if I start getting bogged down in side missions and things, uh, this game could go on for, I guess, you know, a long time if I try to 100% it. And uh, I don't want to bog everybody down in one game and one story when there's so many great games to play and so many new games coming out. Um, it's pretty soon, right? There's some more new games coming out. Um, which brings us to the topic like you just raised of what's the next game on the list. There isn't one yet. Uh, we'll probably, we're probably not quite ready yet to have the conversation about uh, what we should throw on the list and what's coming up. I probably need to take a bit of time to look at the games that I'm interested in as well as the games that are coming out, uh, as well as take uh, what you guys suggest in chat into consideration and compile. And probably what I'll do is I'll compile like I always do. I'll put together, hi Wolf, compile and put together what I, what I always do uh, a, a straw poll, which lasts two, three days of God of War. We'll throw it into the chat and have you guys uh, pick on it. Um, uh, so you're loving the difficulty? So far, so good, Wolf. I'm not having an issue uh, with the difficulty. Um, <clears throat> I had no idea coming into the game what, you know, what kind of game it was or how difficult it was. Those Valkyries look like they're going to be a challenge at this level. Uh, I only fought the one guy there for two attempts, and uh, he pretty much made mincemeat out of me. Um, oh, lowering? No, no. Lowering, not lowering? No, I'm not lowering it. Not yet. No. 
No, I'm not lowering. Sorry, I, re I misread that. I'll re re let me smart chat. Let me reread that. Um, no, I'm not lowering it yet. Um, <clears throat> I think I'm going to keep it the way it is for now, unless, like I said, those Valkyries might pro prove problematic. I don't know. Uh, I only fought that one optional Val Valkyrie. Uh, I think they're optional um, on the side path just for fun. Shits and giggles because there was some treasure and stuff that uh, you guys said I should probably try to get down there. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Um, right now, I think I'm okay. I'm going to keep pushing forward on the way that it is. Uh, you know, it's nice and cool today. I've got the fan going. I've got a bit of a headache today, though. I don't know why. My, my brain is pounding. I just took a bunch of meds. I just took some uh, acetaminophen. So as I say it, acetaminophen. See, that's a hard word to say. Acetaminophen. Minophen? Medophen? Anyway, I took a bunch of that. So uh, hopefully, give me, give me, what time is it now? Give me 40 minutes, and uh, hopefully my head will stop pounding. <clears throat> like I was saying in the game yesterday, we, we started yesterday with a boss fight. Uh, we got that boss down in about 30 minutes. We worked our way through, and we ended yesterday with another boss fight after solving the vault and getting the... What we were attempting to do was to go to Tears Vault and to get a black or something ruin. I forget the name of it. Something ruin out of Tears Vault. So Tears Vault ended up being a big puzzle that we had to solve, that we did solve, and we fought some enemies uh, in there. through. There was like three phases, and we thought, fought a phase of enemies through each... Fought a group of enemies through each phase. And now we've pretty much finished it, but we can't get out of there yet because we're being attacked by two uh, big giants. One is susceptible to fire, and one is susceptible to frost. And so then that's what we've got. Am I dropping frames? Am I dropping frames? Not on my end. Right now on my end, uh, it shows that OBS is broadcasting at 6, 6,100 uh, kilobits per second. My CPU usage is 4%. Uh, I've been live for 11 minutes and 20 seconds, and I have exactly zero dropped frames. So on my end, I'm, I'm good. On my end, it's cool. So maybe it must be on your end. Check your internet, check your source or your uh, broadcast speed. Um, try refreshing it. Or have, Wolf, have you tried turning it off and turning it back on again? <laughs> but on my end, everything is running smooth. Everything is like clockwork here. So hopefully uh, it's not a problem. I know that Co Carnage, I was watching Co yesterday, and uh, he was having a similar issue. He was having a similar issue with um, his uh, stream. He, he had to restart like four times, and it didn't help because Twitch contacted him. Twi the Twitch servers were screwing up, and uh, his VOD turned into like six different pieces of a VOD because um, this t the Twitch servers kept on uh, shit in the bed. So on my end, everything's cool. On my end, everything is streaming perfectly. I don't have a single single drop frame. I'm in the green. Everything's running smooth. So uh, it might be, if it's not on your end and it's not on my end, it might be on Twitch's end. It might be a server issue. But anyway, let me have a sip of this coffee. Cheers to you. Glad you're here. I'm hoping that my headache goes away because right now it is pounding me in the brain really hard. It should go away in about, uh, should go away in about 30 minutes once these pills take effect. And uh, we're going we're gonna to punch into some of this God of War. Uh, hey, what's going on, Magical? Good to see you. Nice to have you here. How are you doing today? I'm a little bit... Magic, my head is pounding a little bit right now. So I'm a little bit... I'm not quite myself yet. I took some, uh, I took some good drugs. Good drugs, not bad. You know, pharmaceuticals. I took some uh, acetaminophen. So hopefully in about 30 minutes, I'll be more my normal self. Uh, it was loud last night where I was. It was loud. So I'm paying the price this morning. No, I'm not hungover. I did not drink at all. I don't think I've, uh, I don't think I've actually uh, had anything to drink alcohol-wise for quite a, quite a while. Probably it's got to be at least six months. I don't think I've had a beer or a glass of wine, or a shot, or, <clears throat> or vodka or rum or whiskey or scotch. I haven't had anything. Caffeine will help those headaches too. Yeah. So I'm, I'm this is my second cup of coffee today. I got up. I had my shave, my shower. I uh, got my stream all ready. Hey, you know what? The PlayStation played nice today. I turned the PlayStation on and uh, I turned up. I got all my OBS and all my everything ready to run at rock and roll. And uh, no problems. No, no audio issues. Everything's running smooth on the PS4. So, uh, you know, knock on wood, knock on smart wood. Uh, we won't have any issues with the sound. So that's good news. Um, I played a little bit. I came home early hours of the morning 
And uh, I played a little bit of that Mafia 3 for about an hour before I went to bed. And uh, uh, my, that game is shitty. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry to all the Mafia 3 lovers out there, but uh, it's just bad. Uh, it's really not that good. Um, I, I feel sorry for people that paid full price for that game because it's free now, right? Two years later and it's free as a PlayStation Plus game. And the only reason I'm playing, I'm goofing around on it is because I got it free on the PlayStation Plus and I have the PlayStation fired up for us for God of War. So I just downloaded it on there and said, ah, I'll take a look at this. But it's pretty bad. It's pretty shitty. Like the, it doesn't run, doesn't run very well. It, it has, the loading screens are huge. Um, <clears throat> the character, like it's, it's jinky. The way it runs, the way, your character can glitch up on different things. And uh, just the, the, the voice acting in the game is good. And some of the music is good. But uh, the game itself is just, it's just not good. So there you go. There's my review of Mafia 3 so far. I've played a, a whole, about, about a whole three hours worth of it. And uh, it, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Um, I'll probably finish it just because I started it. But it'll, it'll probably take me like the rest of the year to finish it because I'll probably do a half hour here and an hour there. And uh, <clears throat> it's one of those games. It's so, it's, it's so bad to me. It's so bad that uh, the longer I play it, the less I want to play it. <clears throat> if I play it for an hour, I'm like, that's enough. I'm done. It's not one of those games where you play it for an hour and you're like, God, I can't wait to play more of this. I'm going to get right back into this. Or you get lost. You, you come out of the game and it's been like uh, six hours since you dove into it. It's not one of those. I'll tell you that right now. Let's get into the game. Let me get into the corner. Hopefully this headache will go away. I think it will. Let me get down into the corner here. Let's uh, get the PS4 on the God of War. Smart of War, as we're calling it today. And fire it up. Let's go. Let's dive in. So we're going to be in a boss fight to start this thing. We're going to be fighting, uh, I forget the names of these guys. Two giants, basically. Uh, with uh, one, one has a fire attack. The other one is a frost. Well... One is susceptible to fire, one is susceptible to frost. And they are, they're Golem of Fire, I think, or Golem of Ashes and Golem of Frost or Golem of Ice. Something like that. So we'll be fighting those guys to start the, ga to start the game, to start the stream. And hopefully we'll get them down in a, in a reasonable amount of time. I didn't see a lot of heals in the area. So <clears throat> I, may, uh, I may have to be, unless, unless there are some that I didn't see and that they respawn, or I'm going to have to do it in one. I don't know. But just the short amount of time that I fought them or looked at them yesterday, there didn't seem to be a lot of heals in the area. So let me get this fan set up right. There we go. Okay. Time to make it happen. Time time to beat the bosses. And uh, so <clears throat> I'm assuming that once we beat these guys, we'll take this ruin or oh, we need it. We need this rune to operate, to open the passage or something, isn't it? Oh, right into it. Prepare yourself. Okay, prepare yourself. Let's go fight this guy right up with the Blades of Chaos. Whoa. I don't think we're doing anything to him. Grendel of the Ashes. I don't think I put a single... So he has a spawn in time when you can't do anything to him. Well, that kind of sucks. He's hurting me, but I'm not hurting him. I don't know what's going on. He really hurt me. I'm dead. Okay, so what happened there? Grendel of the Ashes. I went in there with my Blades of Chaos, and I spun on his ass, and I didn't get a single piece of damage done to him. Oh, I know why. I'm an idiot. See, this is this... Because he's the fire guy. Why am I using fire on... I should have used frost on him. All right, wait, wait. I know what to do. We need this. We need this axe. Let's try this instead. Let's try this instead. Yeah, there we go. I'm using the wrong axe. Ow. Use a strong attack. I'm dead. Okay, so. Yeah, I did, it, I did it the wrong way around. You're right, Wolf. I totally... I, see, I'm not awake. Smart of War 2 confirmed. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm like, why aren't I doing any damage with him with my blades? And then I realized, of course not, because he, he's the fire guy, and I gotta use the, I've got to use the ice. Now, so there, i got to learn that the, their shockwaves hurt. Their shockwaves hurt. So let's get the axe. Oh, what's going on here? 
Why can't I get that part out? Wait a minute, why is my attack not firing? Why is my strong attack not firing up? Oh, cause Jesus, because I don't have my axe out. Oh my god, I'm not a I'm not awake yet, chat. This is warm up, chat. This is warm up. Pay no attention. This is warm up. Can I pull them apart? Let me do some science with these guys. Let me do some science. Do they always stay next to each other? No. They do come apart. Because I'd rather have them apart. So, okay, so there we go. So, do this. Come in behind me. Wave, though. Just bare fists. Just bare fist them both. <laughs> fists only, Wolf. You figure? I can try it. I'm gonna try the axe for a bit, but I'm gonna I'm gonna run I'm gonna run the uh, I'm gonna run Halbert Man meta for a little bit, uh, just because I need to warm up. My brain is not. I can feel the headache lifting slowly. Uh, I double dipped on the on the on the medication, so hopefully it'll uh, it'll knock it out pretty good. Um. And then uh, I'm gonna try Halbert Man just for warm up for a little while, and then uh, then I'm and then I'm open to all metas. I can kind of stun him up a bit, eh? Okay, get out of there. So that's a nice pounding. That's a nice opening right there, right? Now I fire this up so that I have it. Shoot some arrows, boy. I don't think they really helped me, but do some. Oh, God. Get the light attack ready. I get up. Okay, now I'm gonna now I'm gonna unlock and go away for a minute. I want to explore the space. I want to see if there's. I'm not gonna be greedy. I'm not gonna rush these guys. I can get a pretty good pounding on them early on. I want to see what what I have here for resources. Do I have any heals anywhere? Anywhere? What about Jesus? Wow, he caught me right up quickly. Wow, I gotta watch these guys. Run, they can run pretty fast. Were there no heals anywhere? Nothing, eh? I got nothing. I got what I got, and that's it. So, I'm really hurting right now. I need to wait for, like, uh, my, my, uh, you know what? The rage will build it back up, right? If I can get the rage up quickly. Oh, I'm dead. Jesus, really? That fast? So, the only thing, there's nothing in the room. The only thing I'm going to have... Twitch is running like crap, eh? That sucks, guys. I'm sorry. That sucks because I'm... Everything on my end is running smooth. I I haven't dropped a single frame since I've been started streaming. You want... I, I can try restarting. I'll try... You want me to try restarting? But I don't know if it'll help. Um, <clears throat> all right. Give me a second. Um, I'll restart the stream, okay? I'll restart it. Um, I don't think it's going to make any difference, though, because on my end, everything is running smooth. But I will restart for you guys, and then uh, you can see how it is. Okay, so I'll be I'll be back in a second. Give me one second. 